Hello everyone! I'm so excited to see you again. This week is all about airplanes that fly up in the sky. So we're going to talk about airplanes and read some books about airplanes and sing songs and even make an airplane. So it's going to be a good day. Are you ready to start? We're going to have our hello song. Hello, 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 how are you? Hello, 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 how are you? I'm good, I'm great, I'm wonderful. I'm good, I'm great, I'm wonderful. Hello, 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 how are you? Hello, 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 how are you? I'm tired, I'm hungry, I'm not so good. I'm tired, I'm hungry, I'm not so good. Hello, 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 how are you? Hello, 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 how are you? Yay! How are you today? Oh, I feel the same sometimes. Today, it is very sunny out, so that makes me happy. And today it's all about airplanes and I love airplanes. My dad was in the Air Force. So I grew up living all around airplanes. I would go see them. I even got to fly in a lot of different kinds of airplanes, really big ones and really small ones. So I love airplanes. So first we're going to have our first book. And this one's called Amazing Airplanes by Tony Mitten and Aunt Parker. Whoosh! An airplane is amazing for it travels through the sky. And then you take the walkway to the plane when you are told. The flight decks where the captain and co-pilot do their jobs, they both know how to fly the plane with all its dials and knobs. They radio control to check the runway's clear. They can't take off unless it is, unless it is with other planes so near. By intercom, the captain on the flight deck says, hello, you have to put your seatbelt on before the plane can go. The plane is big and heavy, yet it climbs up really high. It zooms along the runway and soars into the sky. Whoosh, its wings hold big jet engines, which are loud and very strong. They suck in air and blow it through to whoosh the plane along. When the plane moves fast enough, the air rounds so swift, it pushes up beneath the wings and makes the whole plane lift. Soon the plane is in the air, so now you're on your flight. The cabin crew looks after you and makes sure you're all right. They bring you drinks and magazines and trays of food to eat. And sometimes there's a movie you can watch while in your seat. When the journey's over, the captain lands the plane. Control tower has to say it's safe for coming down again. You sit with seatbelt fastened. There's a bumpy rumbling sound. The wheels are making contact and the plane is on the ground. At last, the doors are opening. Then you'll come out with smiles. So you give a cheer, hooray, you're here. You've flown for miles and miles. Yay! Now we're going to sing a song about airplanes. And it sounds like I'm a little teapot. Are you ready? Okay. I'm a little airplane, now watch me fly. Here are my instruments down low and up high. First I get all revved up, then I can fly, lifting off the runway up into the sky. Yay! So now we're gonna sing a song that sounds like the wheels on the bus, but it's about airplanes. The pilot on the airplane says, fasten your seatbelts, fasten your seatbelts, fasten your seatbelts. The pilot on the airplane says, fasten your seatbelts when flying through the sky. The children on the airplane go bumpity bump, bumpity bump, 
Bumpity bump, the children on the airplane go. Bumpity bump, when flying through the sky. The babies on the airplanes go. When 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 the babies on the airplanes go. When 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 flying through the sky. The signs on the airplanes go. Ding ding ding, ding ding ding. Ding, 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 the signs on the airplanes go ding, 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 when flying through the sky. The luggage on the airplane goes up and down, up and down, up and down. The luggage on the airplane goes up and down when flying through the sky. Yay! So now we're going to do a poem about an airman. Are you ready? Okay. Err, the engine roars, propeller spins, close the door, our flight begins. Zzz, the plane rises, it, it skims the trees and over houses. We fly at our ease. Mmm, zoom goes the plane, the engine hums, then home again, and down it comes. Yay! So now we are going to make an airplane. Are you excited? This is what you're going to need. For this craft, you will need thick card paper, or I'm using foamy type paper, something that has a bit more weight to it in different colors a marker, and scissors. Do you have what you need? Or you can watch what I'm doing and maybe make it later. So I made some cutouts for my pieces. So there's three pieces to make an airplane. One is the body, one is the wings, and one is the tail wing. So. I picked some, I have some sort of sort of strong, sort of bendy type paper. It's kind of not paper, but it's kind of foamy. But you can pick really hard paper like cardboard or whatever's kind of stronger so that it flies better. So I'm going to start tracing the things. So the main body of the airplane is kind of this shape. So I'm going to cut it out. cuts cuts so I cut out the main body so then I'm going to take my other template and I'm going to change the color I'm going to use a darker orange here and I'm going to cut out this shape So now I have that piece. And then I'm going to do my tail of the airplane. And I think I will pick the same color because then I can save the paper. So now you have your three pieces. You have your body of the airplane, you have the wings of the airplane, and the tail. So what you're going to do is you're going to get some help from someone in your family, and you're going to cut a little slit in the main part of the airplane. So an easy way to do that is just to sort of fold it and then snip in the middle, like that. And then you can make it bigger or smaller, depending how big the wing is. So let's see if mine will fit in there. It will, and then you move it to the middle. See? Oh, 
Okay, so now I have my wings. And then I'm going to make a little slit at the back so I can put in this one. So we're just gonna cut it at the back. And then we're going to put in the middle there. There we go. Sometimes it's easy too. If you put a slit on this side, then they'll kind of connect together. There we go. So now I have my airplane. And you can try different ways to make it. And let's see if it flies. Woo! It flies! Then you can take your marker and you can do whatever you want on it. So I'm going to make some little windows and a big cockpit. And then I'm going to do it on the other side too. And there we go. And there's my airplane. That was so much fun. Now my area is very dirty. So what am I gonna do? I'm gonna sing the clean up song. Clean up, clean up, everybody everywhere. Clean up, clean up, everybody do their share. So I will move my stuff over, keep my airplane there. All of my stuff over here. Yay, all clean. So now we're gonna have our second book. And this one is called Katie Takes a Plane by Lisbeth Slayers. My name is Katie. I go on holiday by airplane with my mommy and daddy. I put on my pajamas. I put my pajamas, my toothbrush, my bathing suit, and my hat in my suitcase. And rabbit, of course. We arrive at the airport. It is so crowded here. There are lots of people and lots of suitcases and bags. I take daddy's hand. Look, daddy, there are the airplanes. Through a big window, I see an airplane lift off. Another one is standing on the tarmac. Exciting, isn't it, Katie? Daddy says. Soon we'll go up into the air in an airplane like that. After a long wait, we get into the airplane. Yippee, I get to sit at the small window. I see another airplane on the runway. The pilot says we have to get ready for takeoff. Daddy fastens my seatbelt and pulls it tight. We can't see him, but the pilot sits in the front and flies the plane. Finally, we are ready. The airplane goes faster and faster on the runway, and then suddenly we are up in the air. Hey, I feel a tickle in my belly, and my ears make a popping sound. Does it feel funny, Katie? Daddy asks. It will be over once we're higher up in the air, but I don't mind. Rabbit smiles too. Have you taken a look outside, Mommy asks. Wow, we fly through the clouds, and then there are, we are, they are underneath us. All I can see is sky and the sun shining brightly. It's so pretty. Now you can take off your seatbelt, says a flight attendant. Would you like something to drink? She gives me a yummy cookie and a small toy as well. It's such fun. Mommy orders something delicious too. Meanwhile, Daddy goes to the bathroom. I drink my juice and eat my cookie. Rabbit plays with his new bear friend. Then Daddy takes my drawing book and my crayons out of my little suitcase. I make a drawing for the kind flight attendant. Slowly, the airplane starts to descend. We are going to land, Mummy says. We already have our seatbelts tightened. There is that tickle in my tummy again. I hold rabbit tight. We land safely. The plane is on the ground again. We're in a different country now. We get out and I give the drawing to the flight attendant. How sweet of you, she says. See you next time. I play on the beach wearing my bathing suit and my hat. High up in the sky, I see an airplane fly past. Bye plane, see you soon. Then you'll take us back home. Yay! So now we're gonna have some more songs about airplanes. So this one sounds like the song Clementine, but it's about airplanes. I'm an airplane, I'm an airplane. 
airplane flying high up in the sky, flying higher, flying higher as I watched the clouds go by. I'm an airplane, I'm an airplane, see me flying all around, flying lower, flying lower till I land down on the ground. Yay! So now this song sounds like, did you ever see a lassie? Are you ready? Did you ever see an airplane, an airplane, an airplane? Did you ever see an airplane way up in the sky? There are big ones and small ones and short ones and tall ones. Did you ever see an airplane way up in the sky? Yay! Now we're gonna do a song that sounds like I'm a little teapot again. Are you ready? I'm a little airplane, I can fly. Here is my throttle, give me a try. When I get all revved up, then I fly off the runway into the sky. I'm a little airplane up in the sky. These are my wings, they help me fly. When I get excited, then I shout, come soar with me, but don't fall out. So now we're gonna have our third book. And this one's called Going on a Plane by Anne Zivardi. This is the Tripp family. Tim and Rosie are helping Mr. and Mrs. Tripp to pack. They're going on a plane tomorrow. They set off for the airport. Grandpa Tripp takes them in his car. Lily is staying behind with Granny and Rover the dog. Mr. Tripp unloads their bags. One of them topples over. It is Rosie's. She collects her things. Sorry, says Mr. Tripp. The Tripps check in. Here are the tickets, Mrs. Tripp says to the lady at the check-in counter. Another lady weighs their luggage. The Tripps go through a metal detector. Their bags go through an x-ray machine to make sure they are not carrying anything dangerous. They board the plane. A flight attendant shows them where their seats are. Mr. Tripp puts their bags into a locker above their heads. They're ready for takeoff. Fasten your seatbelt, says the flight attendant. I've buckled hippo in, says Rosie. The plane takes off. The pilot starts up the engines of the big plane. The flight attendant tells the passenger the safety rules. The pilot waits for his turn to take off. Then the plane speeds down the runway and zooms up into the air. It's lunchtime. Here's your lunch, the flight attendant says to Mrs. Tripp. Another flight attendant gives Mr. Tripp a little bottle of wine. Rosie and Tim go to see the cockpit. The flight attendant takes them to say hello to the pilots. Look at all those knobs, says Tim. The plane will land soon. Mrs. Tripp and Rosie go to use the toilet. Back in their seats, they listen to music on earphones. Tim looks out the window. We're coming down, he shouts. Soon the plane lands safely on the runway. The trips get off the plane. They walk down the stairs to the bus that will take them to the airport building. Catch my hat, cries Mrs. Tripp. They go through passport control. An officer checks their passports. Look, Rosie says to Mr. Tripp, he's putting a big stamp in ours. They go to pick up their luggage. They wait at the baggage carousel until their bags arrive. Here are my things, Rosie says to the porter. The trips leave the airport. Mrs. Tripp gives the porter some money. Taxi, taxi, shouts Mr. Tripp, and off the trips go to their hotel. Yay! Airplanes are so cool. I love airplanes. Have you ever been on an airplane? Ah. Oh. I have friends that have been lots of times on an airplane, and I have friends who've never been on an airplane. Everyone is different, but I love going on planes. It makes me very excited. So now we're gonna sing our goodbye song and I will see you next week. Are you ready? The day is done and we had fun. The day is done and we had fun. We'll see you again next week. But for now the day is done.
Bye guys. I'll see you later.